Hey, Apex Comics. Hey, you doing? Of course, obviously, I know hey, another unboxing. That's from uh, Quality Comics. Quality out of uh, Montgomery, Alabama. Alabama. Nice Gemini mailer. I like these custom mailers. They're really cool. Um, take that out. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yes. Here's some Ms. Marvel and number 22. And Tarzan of the Apes, Land of the Giants. Anybody remember the old Land of the Giants TV show from the late 60s? I do. Nothing like that, but is a race of giants in the Tarzan universe. You got Ms. Marvel versus Deathbird. She flies again. A missing issue that I need to complete, almost complete my Ms. Marvel. I've got a few ones I don't have. The original Ms. Marvel from 1978, that is. All right. Let's open another box. This one's from Lone Star Comics or MyComicShop.com. Some of you may be customers. Some of you may not. So if you would, check them out online. Free plug, MyComicShop.com. See? Plug into the comic. Local LCS. You know, whoever. They're a good, good place. I like to come up good companies who produce a good product, well, produce a good service and good customer service. Hey, hey, and um, I think about doing a, another live stream Christmas night, actually the 26th of December Sunday morning, so I'm thinking it'll be after Lord Crackhead 33's channel. Uh, some of you may follow lord crackhead 33 if not give him a sub give him a subscribe to him give him a like he's a good guy supports the good uh supports good indie comics and comics gate and all that good stuff man hey we have some dale keown early issues here yep look at that i got S samurai 16 and 14 and 15 Early Dale Keown. <laughs> this is cool. Look, Dale, that's your early work, man. Never be ashamed of your early work. You know, you're we're always growing and progressing. It looks pretty cool. I like it. Good perspective in the buildings, Dale. Really nice. Ta Ta Tower of Shadows number six. This kind of reminds me of the incredible shrinking man. You guys remember or not? I'm sure you may can find it on a a free a movies on YouTube, Incredible Shrinking Man from 1958. Reminds me of this a lot. And we got Tower of Shadows number five. I created a demon that stalks Hollywood. Well, you know, that's kind of true because there are a lot of demons in Hollywood. I guess we all know that. Tales to blow your mind. Fright, a flight into fear. I kind of want to give this one open well let's kind of do that shall we all right so the scientist looks like he's making a hybrid creature to actually um stalks hollywood maybe the scientist got jilted by a hollywood starlet maybe that's what happened well let's take a brief look um yeah, the demon that devoured Hollywood. <laughs> Man, okay, this is from what year? 1970. So 51 years later, you'll you see that the demons have invaded Hollywood, but not devoured. Uh, this is, oh, here we go. I don't want to get too much into the story yet, but uh, it's a little clip it. Uh, let's look and see what other flight into fear. Hey, it's Wally Wood. Greetings, Wally Wood here. Did you know that there are other worlds that coexist with ours? That there are people passing through right now, existing on another plane, 
or if you prefer an, another dimension. Occasionally, there's a doorway between those worlds and ours. And even more, occasionally, there's someone who passes through that doorway into weird worlds that man has never meant to look upon. You know what? You're kind of right there, Wally, when you, when you think about it. If you uh, explore a lot of the YouTube channels, that explores a lot to the the weird and the strange. And what what's in... Uh, yeah, I don't want to reveal too much of this story. What's... There should be another story in here. Let me back... Oh, yeah. Huh. Time out. Is this... Is Sid Shores? Okay. Sid Shores here, readers. Come with me and listen to the patter of raining drumming along the roof on your traveling coffin. Watch as wipers cut into reels of rainwater, inching their way across the windshield. Come with me into the nightmare world of Richard and Diana Mason in a little fable I call Time Out! <laughs> oh man, so I like these artists that are introducing stories. That's a bit different. I've never seen that done before. So, this is a Tower of Shadows, number five. And I want to actually open. I've done a review of this before. I'll do it again. Yes, folks. You may or may not know this. But, of course, I have another package from All Caps Comics. EVS. Does not digress. He doesn't wear a dress. Oh, EVS. Hey! This is from my executive box, Cyberfrog Calendar. I've been looking for my other calendar, but now I'll use this one. Got the Cyberfrog Calendar 2022. Hey! And of course, Salamandroid, baby! Another Salamandroid. I'm going to sell this one, I think. People who... Haven't gotten their sale on Mandroids. Look upon the Salamandroid. Yes, look on the beauty of the Salamandroid. Ah, hissing at you. Hey, I'm Cyberfrog's big brother. I love the art. beautiful artwork. Yeah, Salamandroid. There's the stats. The Darian Ron. Uh, Phoebe Sand Salamandroid Hybrid. 11 foot 9 inches. Weight 2,000 pounds. Abilities increase strength and endurance. Can leap 100 feet in any direction and breathe fire. Unlike his twin brother, Cyberfrog, Salamandroid does not share a cyberlink with uh, Jail Sin. First appearance, Hall of Heroes presents number zero. Great. So there he is. And it's organic beauty. So, if you would, please like and subscribe. Ring bell for notifications. This is your buddy Apex Comics. Have a great day.